Hey guys, welcome to Herbie's Reef. We uh, have determined that we're terrible YouTube makers because we have been promising a lot of videos and we haven't made one in months. Um, but I wanted to today make a quick video of an unboxing we're gonna do. We ordered some high-end torches from a um, guy on Reef to Reef and I'm always nervous ordering from individuals, but this was such a good experience. He took such good care of us and packaged these things so well that uh, we wanted to make a video for him just so if any of you guys ever thought of ordering from him, you'd know what to expect. So we ordered uh, three, three torches. We've got a um, Top Shelf Aquatics Holy Grail, and then we've got a Hellfire, and we've got a green Endo Torch that all came in. So here, we'll get to the unpacking. We did open up the box at the post office just to make sure everything was alive. But it came, one of the best packaging jobs I've ever seen. He's got the box actually um, styrofoamed, and then there's a heat pack, and then he's got it separated like this with different dividers, and, uh, and then each torch is in a cup and upside down and not touching anywhere. So I'm expecting these to do quite well, and they uh, hopefully will be beautiful additions to our reef. So we will get these things acclimated and put in the tank and uh, we'll give you, show you guys what they look like once they're in there. All right guys, here we are back. We've got these torches acclimated and glued and um, they're looking really good. I did want to mention that the guy we bought these from on Reef to Reef, is, his name is Ben Seaver. And we'll try to post um, a picture of his profile on Reef to Reef. but he seems to specialize in higher end euphilias. So if you guys are looking for anything, I highly recommend him. He did a great job for us. And uh, this is, just thought we'd give you the opened up view of these torches. So here is the Holy Grail and it's a TSA Holy Grail. There's also an Aqua SD one that's a little bit brighter, but, but this one's the TSA. And uh, then we moved this torch. It was where the Holy Grail is. And then we moved this green one. It's a Aussie green. And then we put some of these nicer torches in the, their spots. So this one, he called it a pink tips, but it's a Indo green and it's a super bright green. It's probably the brightest torch we have. I don't know, this one over here is really bright too. Definitely the brightest Indo torch we have. And then this one is the Hellfire. And I was real worried about getting this one. I thought it would look similar to my regular Indo gold torch, but it doesn't. It's got more green and more golds, and then it's a deeper purple. So really a pretty torch with some uh, unique colors. So I was real glad that we went ahead and ordered this one too. Um, then we moved this one. I, I don't know what this torch is. He called it a jade blue tip or something like that. Um, but I think it's an Aussie. The tentacles never get very long. It does get bigger than this. It's uh, kind of closed right now, but uh, but definitely not like these endo torches do. And then there's the whole euphilia or the whole torch area. And then we've kind of we've redone some of the tank, lost some things. We've had a few rough patches here. Um, I don't know. I dosed vibrant and lost a bunch of hammers. And uh, I, I know you guys say that it's not related. I don't know if it is or not, but I, I think I'm done with Vibrant. Also was using Fritz Salt, so some people thought maybe that was it. So I'm, I'm switching back to Instant Ocean. And uh, we're gonna go from there, but it seems like everything's back on the upturn. The Ghanis are all looking really good. And here's uh, the Amazing Balls Ghani. It's getting bigger, starting to get the oranges on the um, tentacles, so it's looking really good. And then some of these we're gonna end up moving, but um, this one's not real happy right now. It, whatever, whatever happened to my tank, when the hammers started looking bad, this one did too. And then this is one we got that was in bad shape from another guy, but we're hoping it'll grow out. It seems to be a slow grower though, and it hasn't done much. And uh, this one we're gonna keep for sure in this tank. It's a ASD Glitter, glitter Ghani. Anyway, that's how the tank's looking. Let me know if you guys have any questions. We'll try to make more videos and be better YouTubers. Um, 
and get those videos out that we've been promising for probably a year now. Anyways, until next time, like, subscribe,